Hello. Today we are at Sufenburi. It's not far from Bangkok. You drive about an hour to reach here. I'll take you to Sufenburi to see a mural in the Sarm Chuk community. Explore the beauty and enjoy the central Thailand tested food. Sarm Chuk Market, located in Sufenburi Province, Thailand, is a historic and vibrant market that offers a glimpse into traditional Thai life and culture. Here's what you can expect at Sarm Chuk Market. The murals often illustrate scenes from the market's long history, showcasing traditional Thai life, market activities, and zenith events. These artistic depictions provide a visual narrative of the market's past. Many murals focus on Thai culture and traditions, including depictions of local festivals, traditional clothing, and everyday life. They reflect the rich cultural heritage of the region. The murals attract both locals and tourists, serving as a popular spot for photography. They enhance the market's appeal and provide interesting backdrops for visitors to enjoy and capture in photos. Historic setting, vibrant stalls, and bustling activity make Sarm Chuk Market a great place for photography. There are plenty of interesting scenes and details to capture. Sarm Chuk Market in Sufanburi is known not only for its historic charm and vibrant atmosphere, but also for its captivating murals. Sarm Chuk Market, located in Sufanburi Province, Thailand, is a historic and vibrant market that offers a glimpse into traditional Thai life and culture. Here's what you can expect at Sarm Chuk Market. The murals often illustrate scenes from the market's long history, showcasing traditional Thai life, market activities, and zenith events. These artistic depictions provide a visual narrative of the market's past. Mi crab or mi crop is a traditional Thai dish known for its distinctive sweet, sour, and savory flavors combined with a delightful crunch. The name mi crab translates to crispy noodles which is a key characteristic of the dish. Here are some of its main components and features. The main ingredient is rice vermicelli noodles that are deep fried until they become light and crispy. This gives the dish its signature texture. The noodles are coated in a sauce that typically includes ingredients like palm sugar, tamarind paste, fish sauce, soy sauce, and rice vinegar. <laughs> This sauce provides the dish with its sweet, tangy, and savory flavor profile. Fresh cilantro leaves and lime wedges are commonly used to garnish the dish, enhancing its flavor and presentation. Thai cuisine is known for its balance of sweet, sour, salty, and spicy flavors. Mi crab exemplifies this balance, making it a complex and flavorful dish. Mi crab is a popular dish in Thai cuisine and is 
often enjoyed during special occasions and celebrations. Its unique combination of textures and flavors makes it a beloved dish among both locals and tourists. Many murals focus on Thai culture and traditions, including depictions of local festivals, traditional clothing, and everyday life. They reflect the rich cultural heritage of the region. The murals attract both locals and tourists, serving as a popular spot for photography. They enhance the market's appeal and provide interesting backdrops for visitors to enjoy and capture in photos. The historic setting, vibrant stalls, and bustling activity make Sarm Chuk Market a great place for photography. There are plenty of interesting scenes and details to capture. Sarm Chuk Market in Sufanburi is known not only for its historic charm and vibrant atmosphere, but also for its captivating murals. These murals add to the cultural and aesthetic appeal of the market. We found the, the antique hotel very unique in the, in the middle of the Samchuk market, or they call the local Talat Mechan. Talat Mechan, right? They call it Oh, excuse us. It's still called uh, the Samchuk market, ordinary market, very authentic. And you can see that the old antique and all the stuff that they are preserved from time to time and generation to generation. Well, very majestic. This is the owner of the cab. It's been for a long time. It's been for a long time. It's been แต่นี้เป็นแหล่งที่สองของตลาดสามชุกนะคะอันดับแรกคือสำราญลมค่ะแหล่งนี้ก็คือโรงแรมอุดมโชคค่ะเป็นแหล่งที่สองค่ะเมื่อสมัยก่อนมีสิบห้าห้องเก็บคืนได้ยี่สิบบาทค่ะยี่สิบบาทแข็งเมื่อสมัยก่อนเพราะว่าเราเดินทางทางเรือค่ะพอเดินทางทางเรือปุ๊บเราก็จะมาปรับเหมือนกับว่าค้าขายการในการที่เอาพวกเกลือกับพวกแบบถ้วยชามสังกโลกนะคะมาแลกเปลี่ยนกันเพราะว่าเราก็จะไปทางหนองยาไซแล้วคนจากหนองยาไซก็มาแบบเอาของมาขายกับพวกถ่านฟืนอะไรอย่างเงี้ยค่ะโรงแรมเราคือจุดไฮไลท์นะคะคือประตูกันโจนค่ะอันนี้เป็นประตูกันโจนเมื่อสมัยก่อนเวลาแข่งกว่าพักใช่ไหมคะเนี่ยค่ะเราก็จะใช้ประตูอันนี้ปิดแต่แต่นี้พอมันวันนี้มันเปิดไปนิดนึงค่ะเพราะฝนมันตกนิดนึงค่ะอันนี้พอเวลาแข่งกับพักปุ๊บเราก็จะปิดเพราะเมื่อสมัยก่อนนะคะจะมีโจนโจนก็คือพวกเสือค่ะที่เวลามาโค้ดอะไรอย่างเงี้ยค่ะเสือฝ้ายเสือฝ้ายเสือฝ้ายในกลุ่มรุ่นนั้นนะครับเวลามาปุ๊บหนิงพวกนี้เขาจะไม่มาฆ่ากันนะคะแต่เขาจะประกาศว่าเขาจะมาขอเหมือนกับว่ามาแบบมาโป้นเอาเงินเพื่อจะไปช่วยเหลือกับคนจนนี้ค่ะอันนี้ก็คือการเอาไว้ค่ะเวลาแขกกับพักก็จะไปอาบน้ําที่ท่าน้ำกันหมดค่ะอืเพราะว่าตรงนี้ใกล้อันนี้ป้ายป้ายโรงแรมเก่าของเราค่ะทั้งเดิมเลยโอ้Here's what you can expect from the murals at Sarm Chuk Market. The murals are created in various artistic styles, ranging from traditional Thai art to more contemporary interpretation. Wow, wow. this is a, a rice with the kunchi and the sweet pork sausage with all the, the condiments. Is a, condiments is a, the cucumber in the sweet and sour pork with chili. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That's good. Damn. Ba Zhang, also known as Zongzi or Zongzi, is a traditional Chinese food typically eaten during the Dragon Boat Festival, which falls on the fifth day of the fifth month of the Chinese lunar calendar. These are sticky rice dumplings wrapped in bamboo leaves filled with a variety of ingredients and then steamed or boiled. Here's a closer look at Ba Zhang Zongzi. Sticky rice meat, pork belly, chicken or duck, eggs, salted duck egg yolks, beans, mung beans, red beans or black-eyed peas, nuts, peanuts or chestnuts, mushrooms, shiitake mushrooms, other dried shrimp, Chinese sausage, and various seasonings like soy sauce and five-spice powder. Bajang are served in lotus leaf wrappers, which need to be unwrapped before eating. Chuck Market, also known as the 100-year-old market. The market is over a century old, and its preserved wooden shop houses and narrow alleys evoke a sense of stepping back in time. 
wear comfortable clothing and shoes suitable for walking. Visitors can experience traditional Thai architecture and market culture. It's renowned for its diverse selection of traditional Thai food. Tourists can sample local delicacies. The market features a variety of stalls selling handmade crafts, traditional Thai clothing, antiques, and unique souvenirs. These items provide a tangible connection to Thai culture and craftsmanship. Occasionally, the market hosts cultural shows and exhibitions, showcasing traditional Thai music, dance, and arts. These performances offer tourists an immersive cultural experience. As I left Soufambari in the late evening, a warm feeling of joy enveloped me. The memories of exploring the historic Sarm Chuk Market Tasting the delightful local delicacies and interacting with the friendly vendors filled my heart with contentment. The vibrant culture and rich history of this charming province had left an indelible mark. and I couldn't help but smile as the sun set, knowing I had experienced something truly special. Well, until then, stay frosty and see you again on the next episode. <laughs>